that's the channel so today's video i'm going to be doing a massive sheen haul now i've got a huge bag full of clothes not done a sheen haul in the longest time so i thought well, why not we shall do one and i've pretty much picked up a lot of basics because i was starting college so i thought get some basics that i could pair for autumn and winter um but yeah yeah pretty much most of it is basics we have got a few little jazzier outfits as well um so yeah if you want to see what i got then keep on watching the first item that i picked up was this burnt orange corset now i'm i'm an iron because it says it's burnt orange but i think it's red so it's burnt orange it looks more burnt orange on camera but it looks red i think it looks red anyways it's like a burnt orange it's like burnt orange corset top and it's super super cute absolutely love that i feel like that you can jazz up or jazz down but it's cute again like i have done with all my other videos i'll have, have all the prices and sizes on the screen for you all and i will link them all down below because Shein website is so hard to find things so this is what the top looks like on obsessed absolutely obsessed i love the color of it the little like burnt orange ready color still not 100 percent sure which one i believe it is some lightens it looks orange some lightens it looks red so i'm really not sure maybe that is just the color of burnt orange who knows um but yeah it's such a cute little top it's like a basic corset which i really like because sometimes full-on corsets are a little bit too much for like day-to-day -day wear this one you can wear day-to-day -day. and also they've got every single color you could think of i love how it's got the line seams down it that's really cute it adds to it. and then the little like how it's like shaped it's like slightly triangled at the top which i think is very nice and just adds a bit more to it than being like a tube top yeah i've just paired it with a little black skirt but you can pair it with like cargos jeans joggers pretty much whatever you want and wherever you're going you could probably wear it because i would probably wear it with like joggers day to day and then at night like a little mini skirt or cargos next thing that i picked up was a basic black long sleeve top because you need some basics like this i have about three long sleeve black tops but they've all got like crisscrosses something at the bottom so i thought i need just some plain ones so i'll get a lot of use out of them also has anyone else noticed some of the sheen stuff come with labels like half of the stuff doesn't come with labels like the majority of the website doesn't come with a tag on it but now i've got a back to basics you. I don't know, like the price isn't different. These were like 10 or I think. This is what the top looks like on. It's just a basic long sleeve black top. Very, very cute. Extremely well, which I like. Just paired it with the pink joggers again. It's also quite a thick, good quality material, which is very nice. And I feel like I will definitely be wearing it a lot this winter because you always need the classic basic long sleeve cropped tops. I just feel like this is a good base as well because you can put t-shirts over it and do whatever um so yeah really like this there isn't again much to say about a plain top but it's just extremely comfy fits extremely well just an all-round cute little top to wear you can jazz it up jazz it down do pretty much whatever you feel like with this top they're all just basic little tops that you can start as a base and then you can work on it oh hi buddy basically i'm budgie and he's come and say hi come on then I know it's pretty a bit strange, but he's not really like a budgie because he just roams around the house. Such my sisters, but looks like Buddy's filming with us today. Um, he likes to be attached to you twenty four seven. He's in a little attention seeker, aren't you? You're attention seeker, yeah. Okay, it's actually the first to be on my channel, so here we go. Um, a little climbing hall, but Buddy, he's gonna watch me film. He's not actually like a bird. Like he don't live in a cage, which most budgies do. He lives in the house and runs around and <laughs> does whatever, don't you? He's like a cat or a dog. He loves attention, as you can tell. Back to the top. Absolutely love this top. And clearly Buddy does as well. Um, so definitely go ahead and buy this top. And you never know, you might become a bird worshipper like me. Um, I should have just pretended this was like a wild bird that just came in. Like, oh my god, no way. The next thing I picked up was a royal blue long sleeve top. It's got a little crisscross around your waist, which I think is really cute. Cute top loving the long sleeve because it's getting very cold and very quickly so i'm swapping all my short sleeve tops to long sleeve and also i feel like because it's such a vibrant color you can wear it like going out or you can wear it day to day i feel like just as long as you like jazz it down a bit 
because it's quite in your face just for the day to day. To be fair, I'd probably still wear it. Love the little crisscross because it's a little bit more to the top instead of just a basic top like my other ones. Um, this is what the top looks like on. This is unreal. I absolutely love it. You need to stop buying the same tops in loads of different colours though because I have got this in black and white. Someone please stop me, ban me. You should just have an option on the site where you're only allowed one of the items. I didn't realise it has a high neck though until now, but it's very cute. It's where like the original neckline would be and it's just got an extra little bit. But it's very cute and it will keep me warm in the winter time. And I love the little crisscross detailing. I always feel like that just adds to the top a little bit more. Makes it a little bit extra. It makes it more like going outy as well instead of just... Like, I feel like without that, it'd just be like a day-to-day -day cute little basic top. Then, bam, with that, it's an evening wear. So you could actually tuck the string somewhere and just have it as like a basic one. I just paired it with a little black skirt again. I then got a black mini skirt. Now, I know it's coming up to winter, but I've needed one of these for a while. I mean, I could put it with tights. That'll make it a little bit warmer. But, yeah, I needed a black mini skirt that's not see-through. So I picked up this one and it doesn't appear to be see-through. So I think we found one, finally. I've been searching for ages and I just can't find one that's not see-through. It's quite a good length as well, not too short, not too long. And it's just got a stretchy, bouncy waistband. That's what the skirt looks like on. It's such a good skirt. Like, you always need a basic black mini skirt. They're so hard to find that aren't see-through or too thick. Like, you want like a little thin one time to time. Um, so yeah, this is only a very thin, lightweight skirt, but it's not see-through, which is amazing. I've worn one of these for a while. I love this, and you can have it as long as it goes with it being high-waisted, or you can pull up shorter. Pretty much whatever you decide, whatever you're feeling on that day, you can do. There's not actually much I can say about a plain black skirt. I feel like literally everyone and their dog owns one, but... It is very cute and it's a staple piece that you can wear in the summer and winter. Now the next top, I probably wouldn't wear out day to day, but it's definitely an evening top. And it's just this, just this little black lace top. It's so cute. And it's just got little mesh, it's got adjustable straps, which is always handy. And yeah, tons of different colours as well. But I went for black because I feel like you can't really go wrong with it. This is what the top looks like on. Honestly, these tops in this haul, I'm obsessed with it. This is so, so, so cute. It's definitely more of an evening wear top than a day to day, but I feel like you could also, if you really wanted to, you could dress it down. Not 100% sure how you dress it down that much, but for an out top, it is very nice and you could pair it with like a little tight blazer, a little jacket. I think it'll be really cute. You could also put cargoes with it. I feel like that would look very nice. It's also very comfy, surprisingly. Like usually, like, I always find lace a bit, like, scratchy and, like, not that comfy. Whereas this one's actually really comfy. And it's also got a really stretchy band at the bottom. So it's very tight, which is very nice. Just love all the lace trim on it. Very, very nice. Let's do a video on, like, evening wear. Because every single time I do a haul, I've always got at least a few items that are just going out stuff. Um, but, yeah, that's why I can never find outfits to wear. Because half my stuff in my wardrobe is, like dresses little cute tops stuff like that, that i can't wear day to day um but you know if you need an outfit to go out in i'm your girl i'll find it for you next thing that i picked up was a matching pink tracksuit so it's got just the joggers actually look really good quality we've just got a fluffy interior and then they've just got a stretchy high waistband the cuffed bottoms so they look really good and I absolutely love the colour. On Wednesdays we wear pink. It actually is Wednesday, ironically. This is just the sweatshirt of it. Reminds me of like the Zara ones. If you've seen the Zara tracksuits, you'll know what I'm on about. But yeah, so far the quality seems very good and it's very comfy. Oh my god. This is what the tracksuit looks like on. Um, I do kind of look like I'm part of like a Barbie prison camp or something. Um, what is this? It literally looks like pyjamas or something like that. This is probably what I'm going to wear it as, just like PJs lounge about the house. Because it's just not very flattering, is it? It's just, I know tracksuits are just like baggy and oversized, but this is just like, it's just like flumpy. I'm just like, <laughs> I just, mm, I don't know. I like the joggers though. The joggers are really nice. They are see-through though. And I mean, I don't really fancy having a see-through tracksuit. Um, you can see the pockets and everything. The cuffed ankles. See, I love the joggers. I think the joggers are really nice. The sweatshirt part of it, I just feel like 
it just looks very like i just want to say flumpy again it just looks very flumpy that is what it looks like um and it's just it's just not very flattering at all like what on earth is this i feel like maybe if i paired this with some jeans or something and then to pair them separately could look a little bit better but as a whole tracksuit it's not that great and because pink's quite an in your face colour I don't really want to walk around looking like a giant marshmallow. I do love the colour, I just hate the fit. The jumper was different and the bottoms weren't as see-through as they are. Too bad. Like they're see-through but not overly overly see-through, they're not like a window but if the sweatshirt was a lot nicer then maybe. I will say though is it's very very comfy it's the coziest tracksuit ever it's got the fluff it's very very comfy so i'll probably just wear it as pjs and there you go some soft comfy pjs um you might like it i don't know the next thing that i picked up was a black racer neck because i have every single color of the racer necks like i mean i have like a whole collection went through a stage where i was addicted to racer necks anyways i have every color but black i didn't realize but now I picked myself up one because I feel like in winter time and autumn and that you need a black racer neck because you can just add like a jacket on or like a shirt and it will look really cute. Rib material and again doesn't appear to be see through. Sheen's actually really good for that I always feel like. Although it's like cheap materials I always feel like it's really good quality for the majority of the stuff. Sometimes it's like hit or miss like, but I feel like as long as you read the reviews or watch my videos you can't really go wrong so this is what the black little racer neck top looks like just paired it with the pink joggers from the lovely lovely little tracksuit that i love to pieces um but yeah but they definitely look a lot better with this top than they did with the tracksuit yeah it's just a cute little plain little racer neck top you can't really go wrong with it not see-through at all and i love the little rib material so yeah, all round, it's just a very nice little top that you can pair with absolutely anything. Here you go, plain little racer neck and you are good to go. The next thing that I picked up was this crop navy jacket because you can never have too many little zip up jackets and I decided to get a crop one because they look really cute. Again, is fluffy inside and super good quality. It's got a silver zip. I don't tend to like it when they put silver zips on coloured jackets, but... I'll let it off because I think this actually looks quite cute. I feel like navy and silver tends to go. It's just got a little hood and it's just a cropped jacket. It's also a nice crop length. It's not too long, not too short. Absolutely love that. So this is what the jacket looks like on. Oh, cutest little jacket I actually own. Love it to pieces. It's very cute. And I love the little hood. It also looks very good with this little mini dress that I've got on. I feel like it's such a good little jacket to wear on like an evening when it's a little bit chilly but you don't want to wear a jacket that's going to ruin your outfit or crop one does the trick it's also a good crop length like it's not too long not too short which is very nice very comfy i could literally sleep in this jacket it's that comfy i feel like i'm definitely gonna get all the different colors because like i said before once i find something i like i will get in every single color so i need a lot of these little jackets because they're handy to have especially in like black white the basic colors um so yeah now i've got a navy i've got with quite a few different things a comfy cute little jacket i then picked up a little blue crop top which is actually part of the eco range never even knew they did that i was scrolling through and then the one that i wanted was out of stock and then it said an eco option so obviously i was going to pick that one um but i never knew they did that super, super cute top absolutely love the color and it's only like a small crop top which i think is really cute like, as you can tell, it literally is just a little one. Got rib material. And yeah, this is what the top looks like on. The colour is the most unreal colour ever. Absolutely love that. And I love how it's a little top. It's not too big, not too short. You end up having really long crop tops and then you can't wear super high waist trousers with or anything because they kind of connect together. That's when I have to roll up my top because it connects. I don't like the connecting look. You might, I personally don't know. I much rather have a little bit on show. It's so, so nice. Definitely pair it with like some cargos or high-waisted trousers. Pretty much anything I feel like would look nice with it because it's just a basic little crop top. And it's just ribbed. As you can tell though, the quality is very, very good. Also, it doesn't really look cheap. 
and I swear I like paid like a fiver for it, probably even less. Some things from Shein look very cheap and some look expensive. So it's kind of hit or miss. And again, paired it with the little black skirt. You're gonna see a lot of this skirt throughout this haul. You can wear it in the daytime or you can wear it in the evening because it's one of them type of tops which you can do whatever, it depends what you pair with. Half this haul is like that, it's all basics that you can just jazz up or jazz down. You need some basics, especially in winter and autumn time. Although this probably isn't an autumn and winter top, it's very nice and I've worn it for a while. It kept selling out, so if you do want this, make sure to get your hands on it because it sold out and it sold out on the like normal one that weren't eco and then I saw the eco option and I was like, I shall get that. I've never actually tried the Shein eco range, so I'd forever be obsessed with cobalt blue, royal blue, whatever you want to call it, still don't know the difference. Whether they're the same colour, I don't know. I'm not really a colour specialist, don't really understand the differences between them. I then picked up a crop t-shirt, it's just a white ribbed crop t-shirt with little rouging on the side. have got this in black already from like H&M or something, so I've now picked it up from Shein in white. It does look fairly big though. I got it in a size small, but it does look quite big. So we'll see on what it looks like. Do the see-through test. Mm, sort of, it sort of looks see-through. Like you can slightly see my nails and my nails are pretty bright. So I don't know, we'll see. We'll give it the benefit of the doubt, we'll see. But yeah, it does look quite cute. I'm, I'm not sure on this so far. Hopefully it looks better on. This is what the top looks like on. Now, this one's very see-through. Um, again, I don't know whether it is just because I've got a bright white bra underneath, but I feel like this one would be see-through with most colours. It also fits really odd. Like, it's extremely baggy around here, but then it's tight here. It's just strange. I don't really like it. It looked a lot better on the website. Um... See, I thought it'd just be a really tight, little, cute, cropped top, but it's quite big, actually. It's quite long. I don't know, I was expecting it to be, like, tiny little, you know what I mean? Do like the adjustable sides? You can adjust it up to here, there, or you can have it down here, pretty much whatever you want. Or you can have it even longer and have it as, like, an actual t-shirt. Although, I don't think it's that nice. Mm, I feel like it would have to grow on me. I don't think it's very flattering, especially on me. I feel like it's just, I don't know. I don't really like it at all. I just feel like it fits wrong. And it's just not my type of top, to be honest. Material's very comfy. If it weren't see-through, it'd probably be a little bit better. Um, love the rouge on the sides. It's just, it's just an odd fit. It just doesn't fit me right. It could fit you right though, um, but it's just a bit it's very t-shirty and i don't really want a t-shirt t-shirt i wanted like a little crop cute little top with rouge sides um but hey ho we will find one I then picked up another one of the black t-shirts but in white just a white crop long sleeve top which is really cute hasn't got a label on this one because i have already worn it so if it's got any like dirt on it that is why but it's the exact same as the black one it's very cute now it does look see-through right sort of but when it's actually on it didn't look that see-through remember rightly it didn't look see-through we will soon see but yeah it's just a nice little basic top absolutely love that super stretchy again which is very nice long sleeve for the winter this is what the top looks like on front i've gone back to front oh my god now I've got it on the right way, um, this is what it's supposed to look like. But as you can tell it is very see-through, but I feel like that is because I've got a pristine white bra on underneath. Because I have worn this already out and I wore it with like a nudie colour and it didn't show through as bad. So I definitely don't think wear white under it, I feel like definitely wear a nude colour and then you're not going to really see. Also though, you don't really walk around with a bright light with you the whole time. So it shouldn't be too bad. The top itself is very comfy. It's the same fit as the other one. So it's very nice and I love the material. It's super duper comfy. Love the long sleeves. And again, you just need a plain white top that's long sleeved for winter time and autumn. It's a very comfy, stretchy material, which is nice because you don't want something that's gonna be like clingy too tight to you. Because I don't really like things too tight to me. Um, I much rather a little bit of room, so I'm extra comfy because I go for comfort. 
Um, so yeah, this is extremely comfy. Feels like you're just wearing your gym jams and it's perfect. Now it wouldn't be a sheen haul without accessories. So I picked up some accessories. I've got some little hoop earrings. Now you're probably thinking a few of them are missing. Cha -ching. Um, yeah, I've been wearing them. I couldn't wait. I try my hardest to keep the stuff in a pile so I don't use it. But oh well. Just imagine that the whole set is there, but they're just these little silver hoop earrings. Very cute. And they so far have not turned green or black or anything like that. Um, so yeah, and they don't react on my ears. So they're actually really good and I think they were like a pound. Then I've picked up a necklace. Now I don't think I suit necklaces at all. But I just feel like I'm not a necklace person. I feel like some people are, some people are. But I picked one up because it's like a pound. And I fancied one. This cute little double heart necklace. Absolutely love that. I think it's very, very cute. It's a little sparkly rhinestone one on one. She's plain. Love that. Whether it will suit me. And I can find out, won't we? I just don't think I'm a necklace person. I just don't suit them. I just always feel like I look like a dog with a collar on. I generally do look like a dog with a collar on, which isn't really a look. It's not the look I'm going for. Um, but maybe one day I'll find a necklace that suits me. Next, I've got a pack of rhinestone thick diamond earrings, and they just look like they just look like that again like a pound the jewelry is dead cheap on there it tends to be fairly good if you're wanting to have proper diamonds and stuff this cheap jewelry is probably not for you but if you're like me and lose all your earrings and stuff anyway these bad boys are very handy the next thing that i picked up was again royal blue we've got a theme coming um and it's this oversized royal blue um zip up hoodie absolutely love and it's got a fluffy inside and it's very comfy i've already worn it keep falling asleep in it like for the winter time it's just such a good little jacket to wear and the quality is actually really good and this again was so cheap the sheen used to be not that great for winter stuff it used to be more summer little tank tops little cute crop tops but they're actually stepping up their game this time because all the winter stuff is very good sheen, you're very good this is the next jacket it is very big as you can tell it's a nice little oversized look um but it's so comfy like i absolutely love it it's like wearing a dress gown out and very good quality love the material of it and it's quite lightweight as well which is very handy because i don't really like having really heavy jackets like you know when you get a zip-up jacket and it's so so heavy and then you just like Ugh. um but yeah it's got the zip all the way up which is very cute good up when it's raining and there you go, a little slouchy hoodie. Absolutely love that. I feel like you do need a lot of zip-up hoodies. Different fits, all different colours. And yeah, then you will always find an outfit. I mean, my outfits are very basic, but now I've got the zip jammed. And the zip jammed on that part, you know, when it like switches to that. And again, I love the colour. I feel like I will literally live in this colour because it's very nice. So that is it for this video, guys. If you did enjoy, please give it a big thumbs up. Make sure to comment down below any other video ideas you have. Really need help. Thank you. Subscribe if you've not already. Because what are you doing? If you've made it this far to my video, you know where to go. Um, but yeah, thank you. Bye. <laughs>